San Patelem is a French Caribbean island, discovered and named by Christopher Columbus in 1943, and one of the most breathtaking islands in the world. It is part of the French West Indies, but it's an overseas collectivity with a degree of autonomy. The island is located between the Franco-Dutch island of St. Martin and the archipelago of Guadeloupe. It measures just 25 square kilometers, so it feels bigger than it actually is. The tiny island does not feel overcrowded with its hills and different landscapes, while being home to five-star hotels, luxury villas and gourmet restaurants. We are now in uh, Gustavia. This is the capital of uh, St. Barts and uh, if you like shopping, uh, this is place to be. An interesting fact about St. Barts is that luxury goods, for example Hermes bags, Cartier jewelry, Louis Vuitton slipcases, are tax-free. So about 20% cheaper than in the US, Italy or France. Yet daily necessities such as fresh vegetables food and rent are very expensive compared with those countries. In St. Bart's uh, I will buy only one thing and that will be this for our female traveler. Now I also can say that I bought something in the St. Bart's. Through our travels uh, we visited uh, some of the most exclusive uh, places on earth. But I think uh, St. Bart's is uh, one step uh, higher. St. Bart's, like uh, many other uh, islands in Caribbean Sea, doesn't have uh, public transportation. So you will need to take a taxi or uh, rent a car or scooter. Near the port uh, we found this uh, interesting church, so we will go inside to check out. This church uh, looks uh, so simple and uh, we are in the one of the most uh, wealthiest places on earth, so I didn't expect that. After the capital of St. Bart, uh, we are going to visit the main reason to come here, that's the beaches. We don't have enough time to visit uh, all beaches, but we will visit the most important one. We are at uh, St. Jean Beach uh, and uh, this beach is the most famous beach uh, in uh, St. Bart's. Uh, the best time to visit St. Bart's is between November and June, when temperatures hover at around 29 degrees. It is very hard to find a destination more exclusive than the Caribbean island of St. Bart's. St. Bart's was rated one of the top 10 beach destinations in the world by the Travel Channel. The island has become a hub for five-star hotels, celeb spotting, show stopping and world-class dining and has Michelin starred chefs on the island. We are actually at uh, Nikki Beach but uh, St. John Beach is uh, just around the corner.
we also have a feeding station in St. Bart. Seems uh, I need a shirt to get inside the restaurant. Now I have my shirt and let's go back inside. Not only it's forbidden to get inside without shirt, uh, but also it's forbidden to film. One advice, uh, never order pizza in St. Bart. Uh, this pizza is too small for uh, $40. But Panzerotti looks uh, much better. The Rock in Eden Rock is a nod to the hotel's Rockside local, but also its vibe, which has included everyone from Howard Hughes and Greta Garbo throughout its 60-year history. I would like to rent one, but it's uh, so hot uh, and uh, I will stay on the beach. We are entering the famous St. John Beach. This hotel uh, looks uh, marvelous, uh, like the movie. Amazing! Oh yeah, we will have fun for sure today! Oh my god, I saw so many beaches in the last uh, couple of months. Uh, I can't decide which one is better. All of them are so amazing and this shade of blue, the sand, everything is perfect. Now I'm walking to the airport and uh, hopefully I will uh, catch some airplanes while uh, take off. Visitors can only get the same barts by cruises from the nearby islands of Anguilla and Guadalupe or take the Winier Charter Shuttle from Princess Juliana International Airport in St. Martin to nose dive from the mountains on the unique short runaway. Probably that's the number one reason why you will not see too many tourists here, uh, because it's not easy to get to St. Bart. The moment you descend into St. Bart's, you know you are in for something spectacular. We are at the end of the runway and directly from the airport you have exit to the beach, what is amazing and fascinating. Look, exit to beach. St. Bart have population of only 2000 and uh, one of the reasons uh, maybe why it's so popular it's uh, because it's hard to get here, so this runway is too short for uh, bigger jets and uh, you can come only with uh, private plane or yachts. From the other side of uh, St. Jane Beach uh, you will find a lot of restaurants and uh, places for shopping. But I did my shopping for today, so I'm good, I will stay on the beach. Guys, that's everything from St. Bart's. Thank you for watching and see you at our next destination. Bye!